Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to show you step by step process how we can integrate HubSpot with the Salesforce. So let's start. The first way how we can do it is when you would come here to HubSpot and you would go to the app marketplace. And now we just would write here Salesforce. And then you can simply connect the application and then actually you can integrate between Salesforce and HubSpot. The second way how we can do it is when you would come here to Zapier and create a column on Zapier, you can go and write HubSpot. And so then search for an app Salesforce. And then select the trigger. So when there is going to be, let's say a new contact, what you want to do is to create attachment, create a record, update the record. You can really choose what is going to happen so you can create a record right so when there is going to be create a record in salesforce when a new contact is going to be in hubspot try it and then this is like really simple how we can do it you can create a zap so i'm going to choose the account that i have here continue this is my trigger so first name last name email is going to be connected from zapier from linkedin and from hubspot i don't know what i'm doing right now but I didn't mean to say LinkedIn, I mean to say HubSpot. You can also add additional properties. Set up a trigger. So you can test the trigger right now. I think it's not going to work, so I'll just skip the part here. You just have to create a contact to, uh, to do your work. Skip test. Okay, and then just press continue. All right, when you go further in Salesforce, you can simply create a record. Continue, then you want to sign into Salesforce. Continue, allow access. And I'm going to allow access to Salesforce. And now Salesforce object, you just add here the account. Account name is going to be first name. So we'll create a record in Salesforce in the new contact in HubSpot. Set up action, Salesforce object, we can really choose which one you actually want. Account type or parent account in Jesus add here what you want. And you can edit literally everything here, what you need and how we can actually set it up. You can actually also change the way to go from Salesforce to HubSpot. So when something is going to happen in Salesforce, you will get something in HubSpot, right? And then you just press continue. And this is pretty much it, how you do it, right? Skip test. And then you just simply turn on the zap. And voila, you got it. So thank you very much. Have a great day and goodbye. See ya.